Hello friends, Vinyl Community. Wes here checking in to do a thread response, a uh, August thread that Mark Dr. Dead Wax posted about, uh, well, music that you listen to when you're feeling depressed. And it's been, it's, it's been a really long time since I've really felt depressed about anything. I the last time I really remember being really depressed was was right around the time I decided to come out. Uh, you know, it was just at a moment in my life where I was just totally depressed about how my life was going, and I just felt like I was not really living. And definitely turned to turned to music at the time. Uh, usually, when I'm depressed, I like to listen to music that just has sort of a brooding slow vibration to it you know not I don't really like any kind of lyrical kind of music I don't I just like very long drawn out drony kind of music um, just really long sustained notes and interesting just vibrations that sort of almost have a depressing feel to them or a sort of a just a, a a feel, you know, almost a, a textile, or, t or a, almost like you can touch the music. It's just a long, vibrating note that just, uh, I don't know, it just, it just, you know, hits you in the chest, and it just, it makes you feel uh, emotion stronger. And that's usually what I like to, like to do when I'm feeling depressed is is find music that makes me feel the emotions as strong as possible. I feel like that helps helps with the healing process to really just feel all those emotions intensely and experience that experience and move beyond that. So uh, with that being said, I picked up picked out a few things out of the collection here that are sort of uh, what I think are good music uh, for depressed, de being depressed or depression. Um, so uh, things like George Winston, uh, you know, piano, solo piano music here. There's a couple of George Winston albums. Uh, just really nice and slow, brooding, you know, long sustained notes. Uh, really good stuff, to, in my opinion, uh, for dealing with depression to make you just sort of, you know, you just got to experience it and go through it and, and work through it. Um, uh, another one is a new one I just got here just recently, um, and I'm not even sure exactly how to pronounce this guy's name. It's a Greek name, Iasos, I guess is the uh, name. I don't know. He does. Uh, he's a flutist, but he does electronic manipulations of the flute, and uh, very interesting. Started in the '70s and was popular in the '80s as far as uh, sort of new agey sort of music very interesting uh, this is actually a a compilation of his work on numero group uh, i decided to grab one of these and see what they were all about and this one sounded really interesting to my to my ears and this has that sound to it it's very very drawn out brooding long notes um, manipulated notes just uh, you know vibrations the, the the vibrations is just are just interesting in this music and that's like I said that's what I'm looking for when I'm looking for music that's good for depressing times um, as well as uh, here's something even a little bit different from all of that these are uh, Earth or I guess they're sort of a a drone drone metal kind of stuff but just really really slowed down and just uh, Something else that I think is good for uh, depressing times. Uh, these are this is Earth One and Earth Two, or uh, Angels of Darkness, Demons of Light One, and Angels of Darkness, Demons of Light Two. Yeah, just some other other good stuff. I think uh, is is good for just experiencing depression, and that's that's the way I I deal with being depressed is just to try to force myself to experience that experience as intensely as pro as possible and process it faster uh, that's just what works for me I know it sounds it sounds backwards but that's that's what works for me just to uh, anytime I'm feeling sort of a strong emotion of any kind or 
or dealing with a problem of any kind just to just sort of ex try to no don't try to run away from it just try to experience it and get through it and and move on so that's uh that's my answer to this month's thread uh, kind of a challenging interesting thread i've enjoyed seeing some responses to this one i hope some more people jump in on this one getting near the end of the month now uh so uh thanks for tuning in thanks for having a thread mark and we'll see you again soon cheers <laughs>